Hey everyone, good morning and welcome to Sunday School on this wonderful Palm Sunday. I'm going to share with you a Bible story this morning. Friends, Jesus said to his disciples, I need to go to Jerusalem. I've got some important things to do and I want to celebrate Passover with you there. Will you come with me? Sure, said the disciples. Passover is a great holiday, such good food. And what a wonderful story Passover celebrates. The exodus of God's people, the Israelites from Egypt. It's good to be with friends and family at Passover. So Jesus and his friends started to go to Jerusalem. When they got close to the city, Jesus said, I'd like two of you to go borrow a donkey in the next village over. Please tell the owner I need it. He'll understand. When the two friends came back with the donkey, Jesus climbed on its back and rode down to the hill into the city of Jerusalem. The disciples followed behind him. Suddenly they found themselves in a parade. People were singing and shouting, Hosanna, Hosanna, here comes God's king. Praise God. People all over heard the shouting and singing, and they joined the parade too. Hundreds of people, thousands of people even. They started taking off their coats and laying them on the ground for Jesus and the donkey to walk on. They pulled palm branches down from the trees and waved them as they sang. When they threw their palms on the ground, then they threw their palms on the ground to make a path for Jesus. The crowds gave Jesus a royal welcome as he rode into the city, just like a king. But Jesus was a very different king. He was a king of peace. Not everyone understood that, though. Jesus was not at all what they were expecting. They thought the crowd was too loud and the parade was getting too big. Who is that man? Someone asked. What's going on here? Asked another. The crowd answered, This is Jesus, God's king. He has come to save us. Some of the religious leaders murmured, Hush, tell Jesus, tell your friends to be quiet. It's way too loud here. But Jesus said, We can try to make these people be quiet, but that wouldn't make a difference. Because today, the whole earth is celebrating. Well, as you heard the story, everyone there thought that Jesus was going to be this great king who was going to overturn the Roman Empire and save them from the, the bad things that they were going through. But Jesus instead comes in on a humble donkey, not some great war horse. And so Jesus turns over our expectations everything um, that we thought that might have happened, all so that we might have life and that we might have love. So now with that, I'm going to turn it over for some music. Hi, everybody. I just wanted to let you know that I really miss you guys, and I wish that we could still be together every Sunday to sing some songs. But since we can't, um, I decided to record two of them today so that you could sing along with me. So the first one we're going to do is Holy is the Lord. So I'm going to do a quick review of the actions since I can't play and sing and do all of them at the same time. So we start with, we stand and lift up our hands for the joy of the Lord is our strength. We bow down and worship him now. How great, how awesome is he. And together we sing, everyone sing. And then the chorus goes, holy is the Lord. God Almighty, the earth is filled with his glory. Okay, so we're going to do it two times through so that we can really get um, get used to it and sing it like we normally do every Sunday. So please join me. Here we go. We stand in a Together we sing. 
see you but I'm I know you guys so I'm assuming you did a great job um, the second one that we're gonna do is the Lord is my shepherd one so this one's a little bit easier with all the words that you have to remember so if you remember it starts with the Lord is my shepherd and then remember you have to walk in place I'll walk with him always he leads me by still waters I'll walk with him always you get to do always always i'll walk with him always and then you do it again always always i'll walk with him always all right so we're going to sing through this one twice as well and if you want to get fancy and sing with your parents or your siblings in two different groups you can try that and you can let me know how that goes i'm sure it'll be really great so here we go the lord is my shepherd Next week we'll have some other songs for you to sing, but you can always look through and sing these at any time that you want. And if you're looking for a specific song that you want me to record so that you can practice it at home and sing it with your family, just have your parent or guardian send me an email and tell me what you want to sing. But again, I'm sorry that I can't be with you guys, but I hope that you're having fun at home. And um, I thought we were going to get a guest appearance by my cat, but maybe in future videos you'll get to see her. So, all right. Bye, guys. Have a good Sunday. I hope you enjoyed that wonderful music. Now, last week, uh, you might remember, I, I challenged you to do an act of kindness for somebody in your family. What did you end up doing? Well, this week... I uh, offer a new challenge for you. I want you to say uh, a simple prayer every day. As you might remember uh, in our story, everyone was waving at Jesus um, as he walked, as he uh, strode by on his donkey. I want you to do a waving prayer with me. We can do it together. Repeat this prayer after me and put your hand up as we wave to Jesus. We're going to say, Dear God, Thanks for loving me. Thanks for giving me life. We love you. Amen. That's a really easy prayer, and it'll be a fun one for you to do, too. I hope you enjoy it, and I look forward to seeing you next week. Happy Palm Sunday, everybody.